I hate pastels, but I've been watching a lot of Book Ace channel lately and I'm feeling bold. So let's see what happens. Okay. Okay, girl. All right. I've been gone for a minute, but I am back with the jump off going straight in. I forgot to film really like a proper, proper, proper intro. So we're just gonna, we're gonna wing it. We're gonna wing it. That's what it takes some time. So I'm already starting off using the pastels. We are going to draw Ramonda this time. You're here with me for Black Panther for the first of this series. Now we're on Queen Ramonda, Queen Mother, or Queen Adopted Mother, Queen Stepmother. But you know, it doesn't matter. She raised him, right? You know, whatever. I'm trying my hand at pastel. I've used pastel before, but I've never enjoyed it. So I avoided it. And that's why you haven't seen me use it on this channel at all yet. So like I said earlier, I've been watching a lot of bokeh. Bokeh? We're gonna say bokeh. She's one of my favorite artists to watch here on YouTube. She does a lot of work with pan pastels. I'd never heard of those before watching her. And she just works with those so effortlessly, maybe because she has it sped up and it makes it seem like she just you know, it doesn't take much time, but obviously it does take a lot of time, but she uses pan pastels and she uses these brushes, not brushes. They're like their sponge tip applicators like you use for eyeshadow, you know, for those little cheap eyeshadow sets. That's what they look like. And they are for what I'm doing right now. I was like, oh my God, that's great. That's a great idea. She would lay this down and then add the details using some other medium, like, like a pencil or something like that. And I was like, oh my God, that is, that's brilliant. That's brilliant because using a pencil for all this would take forever and it would use up your pencil. So I decided to get my pastel box and try out this method kind of in my own way by using one of my paint brushes that I don't really use that often and traditional pastels because I looked at the price of those pan pastels. Girl, those things cost, hold on, let me look that up. How much do pan pastels cost? They're expensive. Expensive, more than I'm willing to pay. My interest level is not high enough for me to fork out the dollars. Okay, so an 80 pack costs $321. A 10 pack costs 34, so maybe I should chill out. Yeah, I should chill out, but they're still kind of pricey. Art's pricey. When I looked them up the first time, I only saw like the 80 pack and, and I was blown away by the price. I was like, no girl, I'm good, thank you. I'm using my regular pastels and I'm loving, I'm already loving the results. Like if you watched my other pink, Pink Panther, wow. If you watch my other Black Panther drawing, that took me almost a month to finish and I was using a more intricate method. I was like using everything I had except for pastels. Long story short, I'm enjoying the process thus far. A lot less stressful than the previous process. That's what I like about learning from other artists. You learn different methods and ideas and tricks and hacks, it's great. That's probably been one of my favorite things about the YouTube platform. So what y'all been up to? Let me appropriately express my excitement about this film. I've already told you before that it's not a game. I, I'm excited. So, so excited. And I, I just love every aspect of this film. It's already, by now, it is, what is it? 2 Feb, the 2nd of February. The pre-sales have already outsold every other Marvel film thus far, which is not surprising. We're not playing games here. See, look at that. Look at that. Hey, am I the last person to find this out, this trick? Let me know in the comments. Let me know if I'm late to the game. Also, let me know if y'all are seeing Black Panther. Why am I even asking that? You're going to go see it. It's a dumb question. I don't even know what I'm most excited about. The movie itself or the spectacle surrounding it? Y'all, I got an outfit for the movie. I've never, ever done that for a movie. I'm going to go sit in a dark room and I've got an outfit for this. I'll tell you what it is. It's not a Black Panther t-shirt, although I do have one. Okay, get into it. It's a black dress, a black tulip wrap dress. And I also have some earrings from this chick named Dorcas Magdabello, also known as Dorcas Creates. I hope that's how you say her name. I never heard her say her name, but she's based out of the UK and she has some cool black chick art. Okay, I just had to make up some space on my card, my, my SD card. I think I was discussing how I was preparing for the movie in very extra unnecessary ways, like having an outfit. And I was discussing Dorcas Creates. Yup, I have these earrings. Beautiful. They're a black woman's face with her hand 
her face is resting on her hand and her hand is looking very elegant and pretty and it's just it's a whole situation in an earring and they're just as beautiful as I would have expected. I'll be wearing those as well. I'll have my hair out, obviously. She's natural, so that'll be an easy, an easy thing. What else? Oh yes, food prep. You gotta prepare the junk because I will not be caught in somebody's line. P please, we already know it's gonna be chaos that day, so I refuse to be held up by anything. I'm gonna go there with all the food I need already, plus it saves money. They wanna charge you $40 for some snacks in that line anyway. So yes, okay, so the snacks. Here's what I plan on preparing in case you care. Sausage links sandwiches, like link sandwiches. I'm gonna get some rye bread and some pickles. I might even get some sauerkraut. No, no, no sauerkraut. No, it's too much. Gonna get some Mentos and gum because after I eat all these savory things, my breath is gonna be <laughs> offensive. So I'm gonna have my link sandwich on rye bread, rye toast, my popcorn, smart food, the white cheddar pie, my favorite, some sort of chips. I don't wanna stand in that line. I'll probably still end up doing so because I love having a Slurpee. I'm going to shade her pretty eyes in. She's so beautiful. Come through, Angela Bassett. I love her. I love her. All right. Let's hit this pencil sharpener, see if it's worth our time. Let's hit the pencil sharpener, see if it's worth our time. Hey, let's hit the pencil sharpener, see if it's worth our time. Hey. 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 Oh, that's cute. Oh, yes, ma'am. Okay, I just used the Prismacolor pencil sharpener for the Prismacolor pencil, go figure because I've been, I've been messing these pencils up on other pencil sharpeners. And this was cute, it, it sharpened it nicely. Okay, 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 money well spent. Okay, that's where we're gonna have to leave it for right now. I'm gonna share this on Instagram, I'm kinda proud of it. Until next time, I'll talk to you in a little while. It won't be, it won't be long, it'll be like tomorrow. So, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye. Hello, good morning, good afternoon. Let's continue. A goal of mine was to learn how to really put more time into the details. Like I'll finish these pieces and feel like later on I could have, if had I just added one more layer or one more little piece of intricate detail that could have taken the piece to another level. Like I'm spending so much time on her nose and before this would have, before this would have driven me crazy and kind of like give me anxiety because I just wanted to be done with this portion already. Because you know you have comfort zones and when I'm drawing a person, my comfort zone lies in the lips and face. No, the lips and eyes. It's always in my comfort zone, probably because it's my favorite portion of a human's face. Ah, oh, she's so pretty. She's so pretty. So that's gonna be this part right here. Looks like she didn't have a chin, but we'll fix that later. You'll see it later. Oh my gosh, why did y'all let me go so long without finishing this? I just realized that this week is Black Panther week. We are approaching opening night on Friday and it's Monday, late at night right now, might I add. But I gotta make leeway, I wanna be done with this. We're gonna work on her bling right now. I need complete silence. Everybody quiet. Okay, okay, oh God. Oh God, so much detail is about to happen right now. I'm, I'm anxious.
Okay, let's do this. I love her, but I'm ready to be done. By the time this finally uploads, I will have seen this movie about two, maybe even three times. This movie, God, I just saw it a couple days ago and I, like everybody else, am shaking. All right, so you saw me do all that mixing. We'll see if it cooperates. I need a better brush than this. This isn't gonna work out. I can already see that right now. This doesn't want me to be great. Looks like purple crap stains. I don't really have an expectation as far as how I want the texture of this paint to look. I actually wouldn't mind a very flawed look, like for it to be kind of streaky, you know what I mean? I don't really care about it looking very perfect. When did it stop recording? I didn't even know it stopped recording, but girl, it looks good, doesn't it? That looks good. You can't, uh-uh. That looks good. Okay. I was so focused on watching Yuki try to follow Nikki Tutorials, tutorial, <laughs> that uh, I guess I forgot I was recording and I was getting so like focused and lost into this. Oh, I just love it so much. I love it so much. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. It looks so good. It looks so good. I love it. I love it. Let's fill these little blank spots in. Girl, I need to be getting back in my uniform and going back to work. I have detail this week. I hate, I don't like it, but it's better than being at my regular job, which is indicative of how shitty my regular job is. Look at that gradient though. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. She is so cute. She is so cute though, yo. I want there to be multiple types of purple in this. Y'all know the deal, y'all know I love purple. Now you know that's pretty. If you made it to the end, again, props. Thank you for tuning in. This is not the last of the Black Panther series, so stay tuned. It may be a long time again because it takes me a long time to finish these, but as you can see, I like to take my time and make sure they look nice for obvious reasons. I'm so tired. Good night. Bye.